between three and four thousand people in the 1A and 1B category lined up this morning at the Richard and Borchard Fairgrounds in Romstown to receive their first dose of the Moderna vaccine. The City County Health District is getting ready for tomorrow's mass vaccination clinic. This one, however, will be for those due for their second dose. About 9,000 second dose vaccines will be administered tomorrow and Thursday there at the Borchard Fairgrounds. People who received their first vaccine on January 11th, 12th, 15th and 16th should have received a text message with their QR code from the health district. These second doses will be administered by appointment only. If you have any questions, you can call 361-826-7200. And still on the vaccines, Krista Spahn Clayburg Hospital has announced another vaccine clinic tomorrow for those folks in the 1A and 1B categories who are looking to get their first dose of the vaccine. The hospital received a thousand new doses of the Pfizer vaccine this week, and the plan is to administer them all at the hospital on a first come first served basis. The clinic starts at 8 a.m. tomorrow. No registration is required. Bond Hospital in Bevo will be administering first doses tomorrow from 1 to 6. Now this event is by appointment only. Here on your screen are some is some registration information if those slots are still happen to be open. Now if you don't have access to a computer, the hospital has provided these numbers to register through. All of this of course is online at our website as well. Over in San Pat County, the health department there announced earlier today they would be getting their first allocation of the COVID-19 vaccine this week. In a Facebook Live Q&A, public health preparedness manager Claire Ryder said the county is expecting 300 doses of the vaccine. This will be a walk-up style clinic happening this Thursday at the San Patricio County Fairgrounds Civic Center for those who are 1A and 1B eligible. Ryder saying 300 doesn't sound like a lot, but it is a hopeful start of what's to come. Now, 300 isn't a lot of doses, but this is just our first amount of doses. So we are hoping to get more, we are planning to get more, and once we get more, we'll open up the registration again and everything. So if you don't get an appointment time, don't worry. You'll go on a list to receive a notification when we do have more appointments that come in. Registration for Thursday's clinic opened at 4 p.m. earlier today. It's a first come first serve basis to fill up those 300 spots. Well, here are the latest coronavirus numbers in Nueces County just into us. The county reporting 86 new cases today. That brings the total number to 36,440. The daily number down a bit from the past few days. That may be a good sign. We hope so. There was one COVID related fatality reported today. A woman in her 50s. Currently 148 people are in the hospital. 51 of those patients are in intensive care.